you can improvise your Windows performance and solve some of those issues to get a lot of hard disk space back by simply following these steps. In order for Windows to run efficiently, it needs to read and write information to both your computer's memory and to the hard drive and it does this using temporary files and cache files. Both are important but remember both need to be cleaned up as they become corrupt with time. So number one delete temporary files. Take care of some of those temporary files as they're just occupying space. So go to Windows search and type percentage temp percentage and file folder will pop up. Simply open that. Now in here you get a whole bunch of files. Press Ctrl A to select all and then press delete. Click continue to give any additional permissions. When done, click on local disk and then select the windows folder that pops up underneath that. Scroll down until we are going to see software distribution. Click it open. There's a folder called download. Click on that now and here you're going to see a bunch of files and folders. So if you have updated your apps and using best version of windows, you can get rid of these files. Number two, delete file explorer history. File Explorer keeps history tab on the files that you access. Let's open the File Explorer and then at the top you'll see View. Click on that. On the right hand side you'll see Options. Click on that. And now you'll see a section called Privacy. And here some of the options may be ticked or unticked. Check Clear File Explorer History and click Clear. Third is Prefetch. Prefetch are a set of files that help your computer launch your apps a little bit faster. Type run and then write prefetch here. When you give permission, click on continue and here you are going to see all the prefetched files. Press Ctrl plus A and then press delete. Next is reset Microsoft Store. There's a utility that's actually built into Windows to reset the store and flush out the cache. Go to Windows search, type CMD and you will see command prompt. Right click on that and then run as administrator. Here type wsreset.exe and then press enter. Now the Microsoft Store actually pops up showing it has been reset. Next is System Mechanic. Download Advanced System Optimizer in your computer as it is a very powerful cleaner to remove unwanted, temporary and junk files. Check the link in the description to know more about it and download it in your computer. Next is Storage Sense. Windows has a tool called Storage Sense using which one can automatically get rid of some of these files. For this, right click on the Windows icon and then choose Settings. Go to System Now, Storage. Now this is the Storage Sense. Click on Configure the Storage Sense and here check when you want to run storage space. Choose like every week or every day. Second, make sure that the box of temporary files is ticked. Now choose appropriate option below delete files in my recycle bin and delete files in my downloads folder. Next is disk cleanup. In your Windows search type disk cleanup. As it opens click on the cleanup system files and you have to now go through each of these line items. Simply put a text box next to each one of them and the more data that you add to be removed and just get rid of them. And that's it guys, we hope that we could resolve your problems of cleaning your windows. If we did, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel.